Hey everyone, Steve here and happy Friday to you and uh, for parts of Ontario, happy phase three. Uh, here in Niagara, we, we're not blessed to move to there, uh, to that phase, but uh, that's okay. We wanna make sure we do this right. Um, also for those who may not be from Ontario uh, or uh, you know in another province or a state, uh, you may be doing better or you may be doing worse and uh, we're here and that's what these videos are about is to reach out and and to just touch base how everyone is doing so the last three weeks we've talked uh, about advocacy or outreach um, we've talked about preservation and we've talked about education and all of them are key elements to our society um, but there's kind of one fourth hidden one uh, that I'm a big fan of and uh, that's partnerships. All three of those things can be wrapped up into partnerships. We can educate doing a partnership, we can advocate doing a partnership, and we can preserve working together. Like our Vernon directories, we have a partnership with Family Search. So just this week, and you'll find in the uh, eWeekly today, uh, if you scroll down just a little bit, you'll find an update to the land registry um, conversation that is happening. And um, you'll find out much more information in the article. But I will be uh, very honest with you that we uh, advocated uh, severely with the ministry this week on behalf of the organization and on behalf of the genealogical community to um, to ask those tough questions about the land registry offices. So find more about the article uh, below. It's been an exciting um, few weeks, uh, especially in concern to branches doing work, um, digitizing, making available online uh, meetings, uh, just fantastic work. Uh, that they're trying to do to provide those resources for you for those who may not be able to travel or uh, be able to get into libraries and archives and uh, I just want to congratulate them all for doing such uh, a fabulous job the uh, so as I mentioned uh, most of Ontario is going into phase three and um, a lot of things are going to change um, we are, as a society, virtually open for business. Uh, our locations, which many of them are housed in libraries, are still not open yet. Um, and uh, we just don't know when that's going to happen. But this week, uh, my wife and I, Diana and I, are going to be hitting the road. And we're going to be taking our, uh, the society's microfilm scanner uh, up to Leeds Branch. Uh, where our past president, uh, Patty Mordosovic, and her crew have got a student, and they're going to be digitizing newspaper. Uh, so look forward to that. That's very exciting. And then we'll be traveling through uh, eastern Ontario, uh, take a couple days of rest, and then uh, traveling up to North Bay, dropping off their microfilm and their news uh, for their newsletters. That project is uh, all digitized and. Uh, they continue to work on that and then on to Sudbury to see some friends uh, from the Sudbury branch picking up some equipment and bringing that uh, back home. All these examples are partnership and, and they're internal partnerships or they're external partnerships, they're partnerships within the community and that is what is going to make our society stronger and better and an advocate and a champion for family history. So I would encourage you, it may seem monstrous, but if there is an opportunity, I would encourage you to explore it or to send us an email and see if we, uh, as a society, we need to look into it. There's all sorts of opportunities uh, to have partnership um, with each other. So with this road trip i got a little bit of a challenge for you we're gonna do it as we travel i'm gonna be taking some pictures taking some video 
along our way uh, showing the different genealogical things that we're doing this summer. So here's a chance that we can, you know, just share with each other how we're making out uh, during this time and, how, and what we're doing in concern to our family history. So if I'm going to do that, if Diane is going to do that, then I would encourage you to do that as well. So um, take pictures, take video, share them. You can share them on our social media. Uh, you can email them to me uh, at president at ogs.on.ca. You can um, just share them uh, on your own Facebook group or on your Twitter account. But let's start seeing what you're doing. If you're out in a cemetery, we want to see it. A couple weeks ago, uh, our cemetery coordinator, Joe Wilson, and I had an opportunity to take a Rogers podcaster uh, out onto a cemetery hunt. And we were able to take her uh, into the bush, really, uh, in rural Niagara and take her to a cemetery. Um, we talked about that. And, you know, so I want to see these pictures. I would encourage you to proudly display what you're doing in your family history. Even if it's watching webinars, that's okay. We just want to do a check-in and make sure people are good and people um, are well in what they're doing and uh, enjoying a little bit of summer as they can wherever they are. So until next week... We will see you from the road, and we will bring some pictures and some video along that way. So until next Friday, be well, be healthy, stay safe, and enjoy yourself. Bye for now.